Good morning. Today I'd like to take the opportunity to show you all the three homes that we are uh, doing our community project with under the Women of Power and Passion. The first home that is this home, the City Revival Girls and Boys Home. This home houses children from neglected and abused background. Um, we are actually dedicating rescue plan, uh, which is one of our products set. Every, for every rescue plan that we are selling, we are dedicating ten dollars to this, the needs of this home. We do not want to just do a one-time charity, but we are seeing to the needs of this home, uh, long-term needs like the electricity and water bills. But if there is any tuition fees that is needed, so that the children can benefit in the long term, but just not a one-time festive off. Let me introduce you this home and let's see what's this home about. Hi guys! Hello. Hi. Hello. Can you say hi to the camera? Hello. Can you introduce yourself or not? Tell your name, come. Ah, just tell your name. Is that from Adam? Say, I'm my Adam. Is, my name is Adam. How old are you? Seven. Seven. My name is Caleb. Eight years old. Eight years old. My uh, name is Paul. I'm 16 years old. Oh, 16. Mm. My name is James. I am eight years old. Hi. I'm Bill Wade. Eight years old. Look at the camera. Old. I'm Ryan. I'm 16 years old. 16. <laughs> I'm Philip. <laughs> I'm 14 years old. Yeah. My name is Andrew. I'm 10 years old. Okay, my name is Dylan. I'm 11 years old. Okay, come Kevin! Okay. How old? Seven. Seven, okay. Alright, come on, Captain. What are you going to say? My name is Carmen. Say hello. How old are you? Carmen is six years old. Six years old already. Look at the camera. I'm Carmen. I'm six years old. Okay, next. I'm Can I hear? Slowly, slowly. I cannot hear your name. I'm Sudan Jaiso. Stand properly. I'm Sudan. Kitty is 11. Louder. Can I hear? Loud, loud. Nine years old. Nine years old. Regina. Nine years old. Okay. Ah. I'm not. is nine years old. Okay. Yeah, maybe we'll talk to Wani. Wani, is it? Yeah, Wani. Hi, Wani. Come. Can I ask you a few questions? <laughs> Never mind. How is it like taking care of all of them? <laughs> okay. Huh? Okay. Okay. What are the challenges you feel? So what is what is it daily really like in this in this home? That is what you do. What happens in this home daily? What do the children do? Normal they went to school, then come back, they do the over, then they do the rehearsal. So they have a yeah, they do their duty. So they wash their own clothes. Yeah, they wash their own clothes. Yeah, they wash their own Okay, Rebecca, what do you do? Where's your duty, Rose? So what do you do? Where's your duty? Yeah. Hopping. Hopping. Okay. Sipping. Sipping. I'm playing rugby. This one, they take turn. They take turn, huh? So they got the one week roster. So they follow uh, this uh, today, Monday, or maybe she will sleep. Next uh, Tuesday, maybe she's uh, throw rubbish like that. We got the roster. I so see. they follow the roster. La. I see. Okay, okay. So, and uh, and um, uh, what about tuitions and things like that? Usually, when do they have their tuitions? Uh, Tuesday, every day. Every Monday day to Sunday. Monday to Sunday. Right? So, seven days of the week. Yeah. Uh, they got. Different, different, different subjects? Yes. Oh, okay. How are the children doing in school? 
So far, praise God, we see a, a lot of women over, over them, you know. How long has this home been uh, The boys, uh, actually, we have set up uh, almost for six years uh, six ago. Years. Uh, the girls' home uh, is coming to two years plus. I've seen, I've, seen, I've seen the boys, so I was, you know, six years ago, and I couldn't walk, but now Ivan can walk, you know. Ivan used to be on the wheelchair. So it's really a lot of improvement, even I see in common and the rest of the children, you know. So it's an amazing thing that they are doing here. Maybe you can tell, like, uh, actually at this point, what is the, the needs that the home is looking uh, What is the needs that the home is experiencing and what kind of help that uh, this home actually needs? Ah, uh, of course, uh, besides, you know, the, the, the um, daily food as well as the, the, the um, basic stuff that required. Uh, there's one thing that actually I'm looking forward to is actually uh, we need to, 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 to you know, get a new van as well as you know, in the long run actually you know, I think we should get our own uh, house as well you know, in the long run. Uh, of course you know this, this seems like you know actually it, it's quite a large sum to it but you know we are going to trust God you know, really to get a new van as well. Okay. Uh, otherwise, you know, the, the, at the moment, like uh, the two homes are actually rented. Uh, we will never know, you know, when we need to move again, you know, because you know that the livelihood, you know, it will be, you know, sold or something like that. Uh, so this is the, 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 the basic. And of course, you know, for the kids, I think, you know, the, the immediate need is uh, our concern is education. Okay, uh, particularly, you know, the, the, the boys, you know, uh, girls, they are few, you know. Um, Bear in mind, you know, they're from, from quite poor background. They never had the initiative as well. Also, you know, their interest in education is not really that great, you know, strong. So uh, we need teachers, quality teachers coming in. Like at the moment, you know, of course, we, we, we still can do because we're in the primary school. Okay. Once we go up to the secondary school, uh, it's very hard to get teachers. So probably we, we need to look into, you know, uh, getting professional, you know, tutors uh, to come in to teach them, uh, so that you know they have a future. Uh, and, uh, and also, you know, we, we have more kids coming in very soon. Uh, by end of year, uh, there will be more girls, about four or five girls coming in, and also the boys. Also, there are a few boys, you know. Uh, I think the lease as well. Uh, okay, actually the van is uh, actually the van. The purpose of the van is what? Uh, the purpose is uh, because as you know, the, the, the numbers have increased. Like, first, you know, so like uh, outing as well as uh, sending them, you know, to, to school. To school you know, at the moment we can, but the, the, the van is actually you know uh, maintenance is a bit too high. Right, the new van will be better students, you know. So and also uh, uh, with two vans. Then it's easier for us to move it around. Mm -hmm. How many boys do you have? 
At the moment, we have eleven girls who have six success. Great. So this is what the uh, Emily's Women of Power and Passion is going to do and to meet the needs, especially for the tuition. You know, um, I guess this is one part that we can do. You know, through the uh, dedication of the products, so we will probably instead of waiting for volunteers to come in. So Emily's uh, Women of Power and Passion Community Project would like to actually pay for the professional teachers to come and teach them as long as they have the desire to learn. And this is where we can do something about it. Okay, uh, from this home, you guys want to say anything to the camera? <laughs> thank you. Say, say thank you, Auntie Alice. Come, one, two, three. Oh, all the girls come. Alright. Hey, boys, come. Come, 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 come. Yeah, yeah. Uh, take Kevin. Go Kevin. Go all the guys. Sit again. Come. Uh, some sit on the floor. Come. The bigger boy sit on the floor. Okay. Go, 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 go. Hurry, hurry. Come. You also go. Come. Okay. Come. 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 Can sit sit on the the sofa. Yeah, yeah. Okay. At least you can sit in the center. Yeah. Ah. Okay. Then you say something. Then okay. After after at least say something. Ah. Uh, then you all say ah. Uh, Just say thank you. Say thank you. Oh, that's all. <laughs> okay. All right. Here we are at City Revival right. Children's okay. Home. And I just want to show you, you know, our passion in the, under the uh, Emily's Women of Power and Passion and what we are doing and, and the lives that we are making a difference to. So, uh, and uh, this is the dedication from the rescue plan, you know, uh, the $10 from the rescue, for every rescue plan that is being sold, we're going to make a difference in this children's life. So what we're going to do is the need that we're going to feel for this home is actually their education, the tuition. We're not going to depend on volunteers, but we are really going to hire uh, professional tutor to come and tuition them. So this is one step to make their life a little bit better. So uh, signing off from this home, uh, everybody say, Thank you!